why you should care about behaviors and why there are many frameworks and models now in the market trying to see how to build sustainable behaviors in companies. I'm Eric R. Bueller, CEO of the Enterprise Agility University and Strategic Future AI. And today we're going to be talking about behaviors, why it is important and the different approaches you have. First of all, we need to understand what a behavior is. And the behavior, obviously, is how I interact with the environment and impact others. But something I need to understand is that even behavioral science has been there for many, many years, things are changing. When a company is impacted by a market disruption, a new situation, the first thing that people change in a company are behaviors, not mindset. And then the first question is how I can create sustainable behaviors. Now, I should also understand that acceleration in market and also AI is putting a lot of pressure on people in companies. And in general, when we see a lot of pressure from the market, people change behaviors, they start protecting themselves. And there are also um, certain areas of the brain which start working in different ways. Now, what's the solution for that and how I can build sustainable behaviors? Well, I will try to give you one of the solutions or one of the options that is the one we have in enterprise agility. And I do really believe it would add a lot of value. So now that is why in enterprise agility, we have something called the science of accelerated change. And the science of accelerated change is divided into three different areas. And these three different areas work together to try to help you as a change maker, as a change consultant, an agile coach or scrum master, to try to understand better about behaviors and building sustainable behaviors in organizations. Now, the science of accelerated change has behavioral science first, which is trying to understand what's going on, how people change behavior, why. But apart from all the theories from behavioral science, we need to incorporate two more areas if we want to make sure those behaviors are sustainable. So the science of accelerated change has also have Neuroscience of change, which is trying to understand what happens in the brain when people are exposed to accelerated market, which is what is bringing the changes in behaviors. So neuroscience of change also look at different imbalances in chemicals, in cortisol and others that um, basically lead to people to change the behavior, to protect themselves and not uh, connecting with others when they are exposed to accelerated change and a lot of stress. And this is the second area that is very important to understand. And the third area is what we call strategic mobility. So strategic mobility is a science which allows to understand better how we can mobilize people or remobilize people in a different direction and align a company in record time with low levels of stress. So imagine people are walking in certain direction and then the situation changed people need to move in a different direction and then as a leader you need to realign people how you can move people in a different direction by keeping low levels of stress and making sure also people can connect and they have low levels of cortisol which will not impede those people to see a different perspective and also high levels of acetylcholine one of the chemicals which um, help people learn and maintain the focus so in order to do that we need to understand more about strategic mobility. So as you can see, in order to influence behaviors, I need to accept two important things. The first one is markets are accelerating more and more, and that make um, your perspective about behavior slightly different than a few years ago. The second is to include the science of accelerated change, which involves knowing more about behavioral science, about neuroscience of change and strategic mobility. So if you want to know more about the science of accelerated change, I invite you to visit the Enterprise Agility World Community website where we have all the models. We talk about the science of accelerated change and behavioral science, mobility and your science of change and you get all this for free. So I hope to see you soon with future and more interesting topics.